meet America's future investment bankers and accountants. You have to look out for the dividend. I like checking the Dow. My favorite stock would have to be Apple. At Ariel Academy, students learn how to make money. Basically, the financial ratio, it helps your business. Like save money. I think everybody should at least save half of their money. Don't forget your definite. And invest money, real money. Thanks to the school's unique saving and investment curriculum. The incoming first grade class gets a $20,000 endowment. When they get to fifth grade, students will start to um, choose stocks that they think we should be buying, and we will buy them. Stock price for churches in the white. $57.58, and the dividend is $0.14 cents per share. When students graduate from eighth grade, the $20,000 goes back to the incoming first grade. Any profit above that amount gets split. Half goes to improving the school or to charity. The other half gets divided among the kids. We're not going to invest in that at all. Of course, some okay. years, like 2009, there's no profit, and the kids learn that investing is no slam dunk. But that doesn't deter kids like Ariel graduates Mario and Miles Gage. I have my own portfolio and it's just really amazing. I'm able to take everything that I learned at Ariel to the next level. Miles and Mario weren't the only ones in the family getting an education. I started looking over some of the materials that they were bringing home. It was still a little foreign to me, but then they kind of broke it down like children do. And I started getting a little excited about that and then the knowledge. And I'm like, wow, you know what, um, this is fun. Fun and finance don't often appear in the same sentence, but that's not true at Ariel. From age-appropriate learning to an inspirational environment and the ultimate reward, attending McDonald's annual shareholder meeting. Making this all possible is John Rogers, chairman and founder of Ariel Investments, after which the school is named. 200. Mm -hmm. Ariel, along with partner Naveen Investments, put up the $20,000 for each grade. In 1991, Ariel started working with this public school on the south side of Chicago because it was one of the most underserved in the city. 98% of the student body is African American. 78% are considered low income. Nowadays, test scores are on the rise, outperforming the district and the state average with the help of teachers like Connie Moran. Good morning. Check that out. Named Teacher of the Year by the National Foundation for Teaching Entrepreneurship in 2007. Ever since I've listened to Ms. Moran in class, I heard her say, invest in your money, invest in your money, invest in your money, and now I'm going to listen to her. Christine Romans, CNN.